As Alex, I found myself accompanying my mother, Amy, to a prom dress store in preparation for a formal dinner she had been invited to. The store was filled with a rainbow of elegant gowns, each more exquisite than the last. As we browsed through the racks, my eyes were drawn to a deep navy dress adorned with delicate sequins that shimmered in the soft store lighting. I knew it would look stunning on her. With every dress she tried on, I watched her face light up with a mixture of excitement and uncertainty. Amy's laughter filled the fitting room as she twirled and posed in front of the mirror. It was heartwarming to see her enjoy this process so much. Amidst the sea of dresses, Amy's eyes were caught by a stunning and elegant purple gown. Its flowing fabric seemed to dance as she moved, and the intricate lace detailing added a touch of timeless sophistication. As she slipped into the dress, it was as if it had been designed just for her. I couldn't help but marvel at how effortlessly elegant she looked in that purple gown. Mom, you look absolutely stunning, I exclaimed, unable to contain my admiration. She turned to me, her eyes twinkling with joy. Thank you, Alex. I think this might be the one. As we continued browsing, Amy playfully suggested that I should try on a dress as well. Initially, I laughed off the idea, feeling a mixture of amusement and reluctance. But seeing the sparkle in her eyes, I decided to indulge her and picked out a silver sparkling dress. With a mix of curiosity and a hint of excitement, I headed into a fitting room to try on the dress. To my surprise, as I looked into the mirror, I couldn't help but smile. The silver dress hugged my frame in an unexpected but surprisingly flattering way. The sparkles caught the light, creating a shimmering effect that made me feel strangely elegant. As I stepped out of the fitting room, Amy's eyes widened in surprise, followed by a burst of laughter. Alex, you look amazing. She exclaimed, clearly amused by the unexpected turn of events. I couldn't help but chuckle as I struck a pose, pretending to be a model on a runway. Well, if I'm going to wear a dress, might as well make it a fabulous one, I quipped. As the laughter and playfulness continued, the shop assistant joined in on the fun, embracing the light-hearted atmosphere that had enveloped the store. With an infectious grin, she suggested, how about we take this to the next level? She disappeared for a moment and returned holding a pair of silver high heels that perfectly matched my sparkling dress. I exchanged a surprised glance with my mother, and we both burst into laughter. Why not? I shrugged, slipping into the high heels with a mixture of amusement and anticipation. The moment I stood upright, it was as if the heels had transformed me. I felt taller, more confident, and a newfound sense of empowerment surged through me. My mother's delighted laughter only added to the joyous energy in the room. With the heels on, I struck a few dramatic poses, twirling and sashaying around the store, eliciting cheers and applause from both Amy and the shop assistant. The mirrors reflected a version of me I hadn't expected to see, and it was strangely exhilarating. My mother stepped forward, her purple gown flowing gracefully as she reached out to hold my hand. You look fantastic, Alex. Don't ever be afraid to embrace your playful side, she said, her voice filled with pride and love. Feeling a mixture of gratitude and newfound confidence, I agreed, you're right, mom. This has been so much fun. As the energy settled into a comfortable warmth, the shop assistant suggested capturing the moment with a photo. With her guidance, we posed together, my mother in her elegant purple dress and me in my sparkling silver gown and high heels. The camera clicked, freezing the memory of that joyful, carefree moment forever. Leaving the store with a shopping bag containing both my mother's stunning purple gown and the silver dress that had unexpectedly transformed my afternoon, I couldn't help but reflect on the power of spontaneity and the bonds that are strengthened through laughter and shared experiences. It was a shopping trip unlike any other, one that had turned a simple errand into a heartwarming memory etched in the fabric of time. As the evening of the formal dinner arrived, I found myself facing an unexpected decision. The memory of trying on the silver dress and high heels lingered in my mind, and a mischievous idea began to take shape. It was a playful notion, a chance to continue the laughter-filled adventure from the dress store. With a grin, I approached my mother, who was getting ready in her bedroom. Hey, mom, what if I surprised everyone at the dinner by going as Amanda? I suggested, using the name of her imaginary daughter from our earlier playful banter. 
She looked at me, surprised by the idea but clearly intrigued. You mean, you want to wear the silver dress and makeup and pretend to be Amanda? She asked, a twinkle in her eye. I nodded, my excitement growing. Why not? It would be a hilarious twist to the evening, and I'm sure it'll be a memorable surprise for everyone. After a moment of consideration, she burst into laughter. All right, Alex, let's do it. But you better commit to the role. With a sense of excitement and a dash of nerves, I stepped into the silver dress once again. My mother helped me with a touch of makeup and styled my hair, and before I knew it, I was looking at a transformed version of myself in the mirror. The silver dress shimmered under the soft lighting, and my reflection was that of Amanda, the fictional daughter we had created for fun. As we arrived at the formal dinner, my mother and I shared knowing smiles, our secret hidden beneath the playful facade. The room was filled with elegant guests in their finest attire, and I couldn't help but feel a mixture of nerves and excitement as I embraced my role as Amanda. Throughout the evening, I played the part with zest, engaging in conversations, savoring the delicious food, and dancing with a newfound grace in my high heels. The guests were charmed by Amanda's vivacious spirit and youthful energy, and I couldn't help but revel in the laughter and joy that surrounded us. As the evening came to a close, my mother and I shared a private moment, our eyes twinkling with the shared memory of our playful deception. You were quite the star tonight, Amanda, she whispered, her voice filled with affection. I chuckled, realizing that our impromptu decision had transformed a formal dinner into a night of laughter, connection, and an unexpected twist. It was a memory that would forever be etched in our hearts, a testament to the power of embracing spontaneity and creating moments that bridge generations and make life all the more vibrant.